Good evening, Hartisan. It's Friday. Woohoo! End of the week. And we're back with the news. So it's Dame Vicky and Newsy News Trina. You! How are you all doing? Hi. I don't know about anybody else. I'm absolutely shattered today. <laughs> me too. And um, I'm trying to make sure that you can actually see me because oh, there I am. There I am. I can see you. You're good. definitely there. I can see you. <laughs> But so I can't see you, so when I'm talking to you at the moment, I'm looking at Welcome Trina. Yeah, just a blank screen. <laughs> all it says. Really not impressed. How are we all this evening? Are you feeling funky and fresh this Friday? Are you? Are you going out on the town? Are you feeling a bit old for all that jazz? Are you just waiting for me to show you what lovely things we have on the marketplace with good old Dame Vicky here? What are you waiting for? Tell me, tell me. Because the only thing I can help you with is showing you these products. So, first up, can we please... Oh, hi, Davina. Hi, oh, you, Nikki. Who else is on? Say hello. Dolly's hello. on as well. Um, who's on? Dolly. Dolly, my favourite lady. She's so good. She's so good. <laughs> um, yeah, so what are you all up to? First up, can we please have the personalised glitter tumbler glass the, from the Pink Spot Craft? We you certainly know. can. I know, you know. Look at it. Here Isn't it gorgeous? Go. Perfect for the florist or the flower lover or just someone who likes a bit of sparkle and glitter and all that jazz. Now, this is £10. It's hand glittered. It's hand decorated. And it's so neat. See, when I glitter, it's blooming everywhere. Yeah. It does not matter the line I've made and how neat it is all the rulers and the tape I've got. No, it's just everywhere. And most of it ends up on me. So I really envy people that can gem and glitter quite so precisely because I can't. And do you find you're still uh, vacuuming it up weeks and weeks later as well? Yeah. It gets everywhere, doesn't it? It doesn't matter how much you vacuum. It'd be like a fairy spark. Yeah. <laughs> it really would. And surprised, I mean, when all this loom bang craze kicked off, that it didn't spit out a loom band as yeah. well. The amount I hoovered up. Did you just have? No, the large stuff. Um, <laughs> all the little beads and things just go <laughs> ding, 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 all the way up the limit. Yeah. I'm like, oh, they are. Henry hates it. Anyway, if it doesn't just come in this beautiful bluey, greeny, turquoisey, partisanish colour, then <laughs> you can have it in silver, gold, black, white, red, navy blue, neon blue. Dusky pink, neon pink, green, neon green, bronze, pewter, and purple. Um, I'm sure that if you had some funky bejazzled idea of all, like, you know, red, green, yellow, white, just have a rainbow. I'm sure she could manage that Absolutely. too. If you have a bespoke idea and you don't see it, go and ask her. She's lovely. This is only £10. And she does um, the pretty wedding ones as well for, like, your bridesmaids. And you can have the bride and the groom. It's proper, like, sweetheart neck. Oh yeah, I love the um, I love the glass with the uh, the bride's dress. It's lovely. They're so clever, aren't they? Yeah, they're and so clever. Like she hasn't just stuck to traditional white either. You can have the dress in any colour because yeah. quite a lot of the time these days, brides are venturing out and they are, you know, very very different. It's not just white and ivory anymore. I mean, no. my friend got married in a beautiful blue dress. Yeah. It's what you, you know, what you're comfortable with, happy with, if it fits your colour scheme. Some some brides do it because they have a specific colour scheme, so they want they want to be part of that as well. I want black. I've always wanted a beautiful dress with red, like a deep red, almost like a wine colour. You'd be gorgeous in that, yeah. babes. Absolutely gorgeous. I think you should just marry me. Oh, okay then. We'll fix a date. Dame and Newsy getting married. <laughs> wow. It's monumental. <laughs> right, so if anybody wants to see this happening, it's never gonna, so keep watching yeah. anyway. Yeah, Davina wore purple for her wedding. Oh, did you? Purple's our favourite, Davina. Mine and Vicky. Yeah. Oh, did you have you to show us some photos. Dress, or was it just part of it was purple? Or what? Tell me. Tell me, I need ideas. We need Although I'm getting married, I'm still married, so I need to get divorced first. But <laughs> I just love hearing about weddings. I'm not really that soppy either, so I don't know why. That's the only thing I'm actually girly about is weddings. Yeah. It's nice to hear other people's ideas and what themes they had and colour schemes. Is. And 
you know, what know. Um, favours did they have and things like that. Some of these crafters' weddings that I've seen are crazy. Like yeah. the amount of work they've put in themselves to make yeah. their wedding. Like, who's got the time? I'm not being funny, but who's got the time? I might make my own flowers, but... Yeah, I've been people. seeing um, little um, photographs here and there of Nancy's preparations for her wedding because she gets married this month now. And yeah, she's been making all her own flowers and she's made her own invitations because obviously being a crafter... She's wanted, she's to, wanted to do it herself. So, yeah, she's decorated all her garden. She's decked it out and everything. So, yeah, being a crafter, it's um, she wanted to do it all herself. Oh, I saw some of the dresses that she'd been trying on a couple of months ago. She just looked great. Yeah. I, I hope she has the best day. I do. Like, it's so nice. <laughs> anyway, so if you want one of these tumblers, I'm ever so sorry. Look how we digress. I'm so sorry. Um, it's £10. You can get them from Pink Spots Crafts. This is not the only um, string to her bow. She does lots of different things. She does the um, little wood slices as well. She does, it? yes. If you are interested, pop over, show us some love. If you have bought from her before, do not forget to leave a review. Why not? And while you're at it, you can leave us one too. Do we provide you enough information? Is it easy to buy? What would help? you to buy from us what is it that you're looking for do we have to scout for certain crafters that you are after you know yeah. have you been looking for someone who makes their own musical instruments and we haven't found one yet because we are on the hunt we like unique things in our handmade emporium and we have filled it so far so if you want to add your stock jump on board yeah. come and sell come and buy see what's about we definitely want more we do. We always want more. We, we do. just love to show off. Hi, Kyla Lou. I love seeing all the new products pinging up on the marketplace as they get listed. It's fun. It, it is fun, especially when something new catches my eye as well. Yeah. I'm really into the whole cards at the moment, and we've got one on now. Um, this is a fiancé holographic Valentine's card, please, Vicky. Okay, let me find that one. <laughs> I like this because it's very different. I find that... Well, hi Claire, honey, how are you? Oh, and how's Barney? How's Barney doing? He's got to be due home in a week or so, yeah? Let me know how it's all going. Did you make your target as well? Um, I have been trying to keep an eye on you in the hub and see what's going on and keeping an eye on Barney's total. But I need to know how his recovery is going, so let me know. Hi, Amy. Yes, here's Trina. I'm having a bit of a breakdown with Facebook. It's got to the point where I've had to steal my daughter's tablet log into my daughter my other daughter's facebook just so i can see us on the news it's quite funny really crazy isn't, isn't it our technology fails us sometimes oh the lengths i go to it drives me crazy hey guys can just hear you as a band are playing um we can raise our voices for you is that better we'll have hey, to sign you have to lip read <laughs> Oh, don't be worried about me. I'm fine. I'm always fine. Can't worry about me. You'll always find me somewhere. Someone will get hold of me. And anyway, Andy would be lost without me. I can't go nowhere. Well, she's <laughs> anyway, this Beyonce holographic Valentine's Day card, I like it. It says, our Valentine's Day next year will be Mr. and Mrs. And I yeah. think that's a lovely prospect to hold. And it fits in with the thing we've just been talking about, too. Um... I mean, I wasn't so lucky to marry someone half as romantic. In fact, I was proposed to by him going, oh, got you this today. No oh, way. Honestly, <laughs> in my flat. I was just like, yeah, cheers. Obviously, we were destined to be together quite clearly because now we're not. Um, <laughs> but I, that was just him. I mean, he's not a bad person. But this, is three pounds. So if you want to make your fiance smile, if you want to remind them that you are going to be together by this time next year or February next year, then buy one of these. Three pounds. It's holographic. It's all shiny and gorgeous, and it is from Cosmic Calligraphy. It's a five by seven inch white textured Valentine's card with a white envelope and a blank inside. It features the quote, as I said, next Valentine's Day will be Mr. and Mrs. on a pastel pink insert bordered with super shiny 
holographic card. She creates all of her own designs on her iPad using the Apple Pencil and Procreate. Um, and then she produces them on high quality prints and designs and handcrafts them into greeting cards. So if you want one of these, pop over. This isn't the only design she has. She has quite a few. Um, she also has a Facebook page that has deals on it, etc, etc. So pop over, show her some love, find some things that you want to talk about. Let me just feed these. Barney is doing brilliantly, thank you. He's coming home Monday. Woohoo! Oh, that's Target's good news. Oh, Target's at 10,238 pounds and she needs 15,000, so she's not far off. That's I brilliant. would like to say as well on her gut just giving page, it's not just about um providing the money. It's not. She's not asking you, she's not begging you, she's simply putting it out there to say her poorly dog needs some help and could you. And every last bit of profit that she has made from her gorgeous craft has all gone towards Barney's Fund as well. She works ever so hard within the dog community as well to make other people's lives better. You know, keeping up on current affairs and issues surrounding the animal world. Claire yeah. is a great person. And if anybody can step in and help, then please do. No pressure, but it's a good story to get behind. And we are 100% behind you at Heart as Anne Claire. She's a lovely lady. Uh, Pete said he thinks he knows what's wrong with your laptop. If you, yeah, it's just naff. <laughs> need a new one. But yeah, feel free to look at it. Um... I said no to Pete three times. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, we have an auction page running for my little fella too. See, Claire is all about these raising this funds and it's as much as she can do as she can help her little puppy dog. So, yeah, if you want to be part of that, go over and join in. Um, what else have we got, my darling? You tell me. I'm a bit lost. Oh, what should we have next? Um, shall we have Gems Boutique? Oh, it's that a little satchel bag, it is, isn't it? It is, yeah. Okay, let's go with that. Well, as the lovely dame over there has just said, this is from Gems Boutique. I believe it's Gemma Sullivan. I've got that wrong. I'm, might be, I'm, not 100% I'm trying sure. to be clever now. Maybe I should <laughs> if, uh, And then again, if it is Gemma Sullivan, then we <laughs> totally knew that all along. <laughs> um, <laughs> This is a miniature satchel bag, a chocolate dog tooth design. I think that's the type of wool. You know, I'm learning so much these days. I mean, yeah. I can't knit the toffee. Um, toffee's probably not good to have around wool either. But, <laughs> you know, I'm learning. I am learning these things. Um, the lovely Nikki was sending me pictures of her crochet hook the other day to advise me of the ones that she uses and the ones that I could possibly use. And you know what? I've been crochet pattern hunting on how Have to Have you? Learn. Yeah. Really, it's not to sell it. I just want to be able to say, yeah, I can crochet. Yeah. 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 I'll make you a little puffy heart. Yeah, of course I can. <laughs> I just want to be able to Sometimes do it. Sometimes it's just nice to try something different, isn't it? A little, a little hobby on the side. And yeah. We <laughs> see so many gorgeous everything. things on the marketplace. I want to try everything. <laughs> See, I want to learn how to fuse glass and I'll, yeah. I want to learn how to make resin pendants. Uh. And I want to do it all. I want to do it all. It's awful. And, you know, and then I went to Chrissy's and sewed a cushion and now I want a sewing machine. Yeah. And I want to go and spend a week at Dolly's house so she can teach me. It's just ridiculous. It's just ridiculous. Oh, look, Nikki's in. I've just finished a penguin. I love her little penguin. Have you seen one? Anyway, let's get started. We saw her zebra yesterday. She, um, we showed it on the end of news yesterday. She'd done her zebra, oh, um, so we just showed a quick picture of it at the end. Yeah, so she's yeah, her I little really family of animals is growing. Yeah, I want her to crochet a giraffe, and then I want her to crochet a hot air balloon, and then a whole little family of other ones so oh. I could bring it. <laughs> and it'd be like, you know, some weird scene from Lion King with a hot air balloon in it. Yeah, absolutely. Why not, you know? Hakuna Matata, got a crocheting face. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, back to the bag. So sorry, Gemma. Um, this beautiful miniature satchel bag in chocolate dog tooth is perfect size for your essentials. Ideal summer bag, lightweight and durable. Adjustable nylon strap and secured flap with a magnetic fastening. The bag is 19 centimetres long, and I have this random bit of, what is this? What is this? <laughs> um, 
the bag is 19 centimetres long, 19 centimetres wide and 6 centimetres in depth. Please be aware that these bags are made to order and can take up to two weeks to reach you, but she is like super quick and totes brilliant, so probably not that long. Um, also, you, they offer free UK postage to all of you as well, so what a bargain. Fabulous. If you like one of these, they are £24. And she's like epically talented, and she stays to her country roots. So if you want, if tweed is your thing, then go over there. Mm. If florals are your thing, then go and visit Gemma. She's just a bit of an awesome chick, to be fair. Awesome, awesome. Let me read these. It is listed on my Etsy shop, but not on Hearts and yet. Well, that's just not good enough, Nikki. You can't <laughs> tell me it's listed somewhere else and not on my beautiful marketplace. And I can't buy it if it's on Etsy. I can't run a marketplace and then buy it off of Etsy. What no, are you doing it's not on. We don't do that. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> but to be fair, I haven't been on the marketplace all day yesterday. The other two dealt with it, so I'm really not missing out right now. But I am going back to go and fill my geek need of these things <laughs> in about 40 minutes. <laughs> Right, my friend has a huge crochet business and she does tutorials. I said, oh, yes, do, Carla. Oh, my goodness. I'm always singing, Amy. Singing on the news. Just singing on the news. Because do you know what? Sometimes, I mean, I love our creatives and I love our products. But sometimes, just sometimes, I want to be a bit different. Yeah. Like, I love all these things. But sometimes I just want to burst out in song. You know, and tell you how much love I have for it. Can you feel the love tonight? <laughs> you see? You see? <laughs> Do you get me now, fam? Do ya? Anyway, next product, please, game. <sighs> see if I'm just everyone's got a Chris. Right, let's have um <laughs> let's have the glass pendant from Lucy Luckett's studio. Ooh, this I think it's a pendant. Is it a pendant? Sleep, darling, I need to look at how to do digital listing on Heartland. Nikki, my love, we will help you there. We will indeed. It's actually a lot easier than normal listing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and to be fair, the first time I did it, the creative I was looking after ended up teaching me. <laughs> always good. Always. <laughs> and we learn from me. each other. That's what it is. Put in. We learn from each other. We do indeed. Always yeah. there to help. This is the Skia Miniature Landscape. It's only £10. This amazing, unique gift is just ideal for someone who loves skiing and has everything that, you know, they could possibly want. You know? It's great. Because you can be sure they won't have one of these. Now, as I said, this is £10. The adrenaline pumping ready to descend at speed down the mountain. This amazing, unique gift is just ideal for someone who loves doing just that. When I went skiing, I went with the school. Um, we were supposed to go for two weeks. I lasted four hours on the slopes before I broke my leg. Oh, no. So, yeah, sat at the mountain with a St. Bernard called Maggie for the next ten days. And while everybody else went, shoop, 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 right there, trainer. Shoop, shoop. Oh, and no. That's fine. And there was me going, yeah, it's great. Love it. <laughs> All that money, all that way. Yeah. To sit, to sit oh, there and watch everyone else have fun. Rude. Not good. <sighs> anyway, this, if you would like it, will be sent lovingly packed, ready for gifting, or can be collected from her shop in Cornwall. Whichever you choose, it will arrive in your hands, in your possession. Perfect as the day that she made it. She does so many awesome things over in her shop, so go over and have a look. And I've never seen anything quite like this. How did she get it so small and so... I know, I'm intrigued how she actually got that into the glass. Yeah, me too. I think we all need to go on a heart as -an workshop down at her um, studio. Yes, definitely. She can teach I mean, but she's got her own studio, she's open, we can book and make an appointment. Why don't we not just go and just sit there fascinated? Because that looks... You know when you go to the beach... And you get them like bottles of sand and you can make yes. pictures of them. Yes. That's what that reminds me of. It's very cleverly done, isn't it? She is just so clever. I'm intrigued to know how that's been done. Yeah, I mean, I can't stop looking at it now. 
So yes, if you'd like one of these, pop over, go and see Lucy Lockett's studio. Um, <clears throat> she has so many different things going on in there. She slumps bottles and all sorts of clever little things. She is. I haven't got a clue. I just know that it looks amazing. I it does. It still looks really great when it's finished. Everything looks really great. Do you know, I'm so impressed as well with the quality of the photos that are coming through the marketplace at the moment. Because yeah. I must admit, that is one of my biggest downfalls of pictures of my products. I'm just not very good at it. No. But the it took me ages to get anywhere near a good photograph. It's the worst. No, but... It's the hardest thing, isn't it, for a crafter to take. You, you make all these gorgeous products and then yeah. the... the the thing that holds you back is the photographs. And then getting them out there and mm-hmm. then you think, oh my goodness, I've got to go to work and I've got to do this. When am I going to have time to do my social media? Yeah. But things like this do work for you, by the way. So, you know, if you are struggling with your social media, if you are struggling to get your products out there, part of the packages over on Heartisan do provide this. We don't just yeah. share... Um, a picture of what you do we like to talk about you too we like to get into the nitty gritty um and especially for those of you who don't like to go live yourself I mean Facebook love this sort of stuff they yeah. they love to share you especially so you know if it's a live and then you have your conversations within your comments and you talk to each other on here I mean I've actually made for funnily enough my best friend talk about her a lot on here Erica Jackson coffee monkey I met her through Heartadan. We have our one-year Facebook friend anniversary today. Oh, have you? Oh, yeah. happy friend anniversary! <laughs> it's happy Trina and Erica Day today. Oh, how amazing! Um, I know it's really cute though. But I actually met her by watching a live and started messaging and asking her a question in the comments. Then I realised that she was an admin, and so am I. Yeah, and became friends that way. Yeah, it's lovely, so, isn't it? And then you get organically shared, random people will see your lives. I mean, I've done lives over on other people's pages, and we've had people from, like, Korea and America jump on yeah. and Japan, all like, having a chat. And I'm like, who are you? Um, hi. Normally, you only get spoken to if they've got a question yeah. or, you know, they know you. So when random people start jumping on, that really freaks me out. And I'm like, oh, I don't it just shows you how we get all around the world, doesn't it? Yeah, and you just don't realise the reach. I mean, I have a lot of American friends and Canadian friends, like, from being online. But you really don't realise the magnitude of people that can see your stuff Uh, just by sharing it. Yeah. Which is why we do it. We love it. Love it. Right, what have we got next? What have we got Right, we have got, um, shall we have Nick So Crafty? Oh, my favourite, my little Sammy. I love her. She's got a little cuddle blankets, aren't they? Yeah, these are gorgeous. They are gorgeous. And do you know what? Right, I do I do notice we tend to show a lot of Sam's knitted items, because obviously she knits, but like hats and yeah. jumpers. And I'm like, we're in a heat wave. What's, <laughs> what is up with people? <laughs> and now we've got this. Now this screams to me, hug me, love me, take yeah. care of me. Um, these are fully CE tested as well. I know she she tortured some of these to make sure they were safe. Don't know how people do it. Um, but the Scones Rule Guidelines, they do have their certificates, so they are perfect for babies. Um, the little cuddle bear blanket is for a baby or a toddler or even your child who loves to sleep with something soft. Um, by the way, CE testing is a legal requirement in Europe, and this just means that all the materials are compliant and tests have been carried out under European toy strict safety regulations. Did you see that? Think about that. Then. <laughs> um, the size is approximately 16 to 18 inches square, depending on the pattern, and with its double thickness, it's like two blankets in one, which will help you feel all warm and snug. What more could you want? Made with DK wool, it's soft for cuddling. Please choose a colour from the list, and this will be the main blanket. Um, for the bottom of the blanket and then the bare colour, send a message on Facebook or email. Now, I like this because you can have it in so many different options, and she has a plethora of colours. I do believe there's over 80. Yeah, it's crazy. Colours. Didn't even know that many colours existed. No, not me. Blue, red, green, I'm out. Turn down. <laughs> um, there are five different patterns to choose from which will be knitted on the top of the blanket. So please let her know which one you would like if you do want one of these. 
Um, she has so many different things in her shop. Now, a lot of them, as I said, will be um, more suitable for the winter, but she's got these funky headbands, and you use them as, like, cover up your hair, you know, um, you can use them as a sweatband, you can use them in the gym, and they're quite versatile as well, and she's very careful so they're not too taut, you know, so they don't, they're not too heavy, yeah. they're, they're not too weighty either, and she's very... She's very talented. I've got one of her mermaid blankets. This thing is huge. I don't know <laughs> how she sat there for so long. And I literally, I do. I put it on my feet and I'm like, part of your world, I'm a mermaid. Fashion flounder about you. And then as she walks in, it's like, what is wrong with you? Do you want a cup of tea? I'm like, yes, just put it next to me and my shell bra. Don't I look amazing? <laughs> you don't get a fork and comb your hair with your fork, do you? <laughs> <laughs> so I expected you to say yes then. <laughs> it's a dingle hopper. That's the one. <laughs> yeah. And I've got my own schnaff black as well. Yeah. <laughs> but see, my, most people would like it if the sea witch stole my voice because then I wouldn't have to try and sing to you. <laughs> I'm more like Vanessa. In fact, I am a bit more like her, so that's, that's me when I get out of bed. <sighs> a bit like that. Every morning, people just flee for miles. Oh, God, it's awake, it's up, quick, right. <laughs> Move out of the way. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And it's like a stampede. You can hear them through the flats. Like, no! Anyway, <sighs> £25 if you want one of these. Sam Harrod over at Nitso Crafty. She's blooming awesome. She's also one of our mad madmen. Um, she runs the Imaginarium, she does an awesome job with us over on the MP as well and just generally wants to answer your questions and make your business successful. So if you've got any questions, get at her. She's just awesome. Awesome. Um, yeah. Next. Fabulous. Next? Right, Let's what have we got next? Let's do a bit of me. It's not mine, but it's a bit of me, you know. What are we right. doing? Are we doing the book fold, yeah? Yeah. yeah, I do. Is this Zoe? This is Zoe, isn't it? No, yeah, Creations, oh, it's creations, creations by, by Butterfly. I'm such a liar. It's Katrina. <laughs> right, Katrina Jane Benton is awesome. She is also a madman. Creations by a Butterfly. Now, this is a Mr. and Mrs. Completed book sculpture. So it's £32.99. And look at it, it's gorgeous. Stands out, perfectly readable. And just, it's perfect for like a wedding gift or, you know, just married, just because you want to brighten up the home, mm. an anniversary gift. And I think they're really unique. I mean, I make them too, so I would say that. But I like the way how they're so intricate. I like that she's folded it down to the point. Everything all meets. Every page has been used. It really stands out at you. And it's just so good. I just love her. Love her work. Love her. She also does the patterns as well. So if you would like to make one yourself, there will be an available pattern with it as well. So you can say, look, don't want the completed book fold. Can you please send me the pattern? She will yeah. charge you for the pattern and you can make your own. They're relatively fun to do. You just have to have time and patience. But I really enjoy them. So I, um, but I must admit, she's been doing it for a lot longer than me. And she just sent me new software so I can play. So oh, she's fabulous. teaching me more of her craft. How cool is that? See, partisans help each other. We love it. We love it. Uh, love this, that's cheap for the work that's going to, indeed Amy, they do, they take hours, um, each of the pages have been carefully marked and then folded to create the words Mr and Mrs inside, um, this is available now, it's already made, done, ready and waiting, if you want her, get at her, she also does key rings, she does paper cuts, she does engraving. She does all sorts of things. Yeah, she turns the hand to most things, doesn't she? Oh, she does reusable crochet pads for your face. Yeah. What's it called? Oh, yeah, the, yeah, the scrubbies things. Yeah, yeah. The scrubbies. Yeah, she does those as well. The work is endless. She's everywhere. She's also a home educator as well. This woman is, if she's not a dance class, she's a, an educational thing. She's at karate or swimming or she's crafting. I don't know how she gets time. I really don't. <laughs> So if you like any of her stuff and you want to go and see some more of it, pop over to Creations by a Butterfly and hit the lady up. Hit the lady up. Likes it. Right. Can we have the tea light holder, please? 
Mika, there you go. I really like this. Oh, I do. I think it's really pretty. It Very is. rustic. It is. And that's actually what it's um, described as. Oh, well. is it? Yes, rustic natural driftwood tea oh, light yeah. holder. Isn't it gorgeous? And it's four to six pounds. Now, the reason it is four to six pounds is because there used to be three options of this. There was, I think there was a three tier one, a single one, a two floral one. And you can have it like gold and glitter stained on the outside as well. There are quite a few options. Uh, but now there's only two. This one's sold. Uh, this is from our lovely Claire Blake as well. We were just talking about her earlier. And it's disappeared on me again. Anyway. Perfect way to add stunning rustic character to your home, wedding or any special event. Uh, made from real natural driftwood, each unique piece is stained with a high quality wood stain and then lightly embellished using the finest decoupage technique. Then sealed to ensure it remains unblemished in beauty for years to come. Now, I have one of Claire's beautiful makes. I have a little plaque in a heart and it says Marley on it. It's got a picture of my little snake who died on it. Yeah. Um, but it's as beautiful now as the day it arrived. And it was a surprise as well. And it hangs over my desk. So I can vouch for Claire and the amazing things that she makes. She does make some really, really heartfelt items. So if you want to get over to her, she is the Creative Craft Boutique. Lots and lots of things on offer, and if you want one of these in particular, they are four to six pounds depending on the design that you choose. Um, what else do we have, my dear? Right, we have um, the star earrings. Oh, uh, yes, those are what we do. These are from the lovely Love Ella jewellery. I love her stuff. They're really, really different as well. I mean, you see lots of single stars on their own, or you see huge, big ones, like, you know, the huge hoops you get. But these are very delicate, they're very simplistic, and they're still just as stunning. They are only £6. Um, beautiful cascading star drop earring, um, earring backs, sorry. Oh, my stomach's going... <laughs> these, <laughs> these star earrings are part of the cascading star collection, the drop of stars are attached to the butterfly earring at the back and can be worn with any of your own studs. This is a great way to change up the look of your existing earrings. So instead of going out and buying a brand new pair every time, you can wear some old ones and jazz them up with some new dangly stars at the back. And I'm sure it can tie in with any um, outfit that you've chosen to wear as well. See, I always tend to mess with dangly earrings and they end up breaking no. them. I shouldn't be allowed. Um... <clears throat> As these backdrops fit onto any earring, um, excuse me, any earring post, they are super versatile, giving you so many different looks. And for six pounds, you can't go wrong, really, can you? No, that's really good. Yeah, dress yourself up and dress yourself down. It wouldn't really matter with these. They'd go with anything, wouldn't they? If you wanted to make a statement during the day and you just wanted to jazz something up of an evening, it would work on both levels. Um, lots and lots and lots of jewellery in her shop. Love Ella Jewellery. Pop over. Go and visit her on social media as well. Always nice to see you on Facebook pages and Instagrams and Twitters and Pinterest. Saying hi, pinning things. You know, it's really nice to see who's about and who's following us as well. And who we're impressing. That's always nice to know. Always nice to have repeat custom too. So if you have been somewhere before, let us know that you're back again. Hi, I got this from you last time. Yeah. Would really like to buy this it does give us that little boost and it likes it sort of shows us we're heading in the right direction as well it so does yeah like, yeah nice to see returning it. customers next up can we have the stables plan i think we had this one the other day yeah i think it was on earlier in the week mm -hmm. sorry really dry throat and it's busy in it now i really need to burp again no i I used to horse ride years ago, and this is so true, that oh. horsey people spend so much time at the stables, not just, yeah, you know, be. not just riding the horses, they're mucking them out, you know, grooming them, feeding them. Um, I used to have a friend um, that had horses, which is why I got into horse riding, and yeah. I, I used to help her go and look after the horses, or I'd look after them if she went away on holiday, um, and it is, it is true, you, you literally live at the stables or at the field, wherever you happen to have your horses. 
and it, it is it is nice that someone's highlighted it you know I, I obviously don't think very much about horses because I've never had one I don't often get to ride and you know I have a dog so I have but then I have unconventional pets like snakes so I get that you know those those pets and, and those things aren't always as openly appreciated as maybe some one of the mill pets like a cat and a dog do you see what I mean yeah are we still live? Because I seem to have lost our feed. Yes. Oh. Yeah, says unknown error. Well, can you know about it? Because I can't see any board of this, everybody. I can still see us live on uh, on the page. I'm just trying to reload. Bear with me a second. Oh, there we are. There we are. I you found us. us. <laughs> I found us. And now it won't open at all. Oh, there we go. I'm back. I'm back. I'm all back. <laughs> Oh, I'm um, scared of getting wrong. I've now turned my laptop on and I'm working on my pattern. List. Don't be scared, Nikki. <laughs> it's all good. Don't worry. It's all don't, don't worry. Don't worry. If you would like one of these gorgeous plaques, by the way, they are ten pounds. It's a brown wooden horse heartbeat plaque, um, and they are from May Contain Sparkle, the lovely Jane. Now, let me tell you a bit about this. This brown wooden horse heartbeat plaque, which is perfect for the horse lover, in addition to being unusual. A unique and fun gift which will brighten your home. This oak veneered sign is a natural oak colour with design added using a matte brown vinyl. The sign is completed with string to hang it on the wall. Every sign is made by her with love and care, meaning it can take up to seven working days to reach you, but she will endeavour to get it to you quicker. Um... No two items, obviously, are the same. Everything is handmade and therefore totally unique, just like her and just like you. So if you want one, get at her, go and order one. On the MP now, available at £10 with £1.60 for postage. Beautiful. We've got two left. Uh, yes, I think we have, yeah. So which one do you want first? Either, you pick. All right, then. Let's go with the basket. Oh, is that because I'm a bit of a basket cake? <laughs> well, you said it, not me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> see, I see what you were doing there. I see. I know how it is, Vicky. I know how it is. Completely true, though. <laughs> Can't deny it. Come on. <laughs> um, if you would like one of these, this is one of our newer creatives, actually. I'm very really talking to you today. How funny. Um, this is a grey crocheted storage basket, and it is £30. She makes the storage baskets to order, so although some stock is currently available from quality, and they're made from quality branded wool, by the way, it's 100% cotton, some stock may be available, but you may have to wait a little while while she crochets it. It's not just available in a single colour either, you can have them in two or three colour tones. Um, boom, boom, boom. I keep doing, they keep touching my notes, they keep going everywhere because it's on my phone. <laughs> there are so many uses as seen in the pictures general household items storage of toys in the nursery or perhaps even your craft items i could see like people who knit like sam having them balls of wool in them. yeah balls of wool in there definitely yeah i couldn't really use it for my crafting stuff because it's all gems and paper set go everywhere i'm a bit useless really yeah. but i do have lots of teddies so i could use it how she has in the picture <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. I want a teddy basket. I want a teddy basket. <laughs> you could even use it as a traditional basket to carry items from one room to the other. You could put your folded up washing in it, couldn't you? Carry it from one room to the other. It's you nice could and too, soft yes. to carry too. Um, washing and size instructions. They are washable at 30 degrees. Sizes are approximate for the grey crochet storage basket. Diameter of base is 25 centimetres and the height is approximately 20 centimetres. And um, by the way, the price is for the basket only. It does not like, include all those gorgeous little lovelies that she's hidden inside it. So if you'd like one, then please, please go over and see. And um, they will deliver personally as well if you live within a five mile radius to the lovely lady herself um, in Burnham on Sea. And um, or it will be shipped by courier currently in the UK only. So if you would like one, pop over to her shop, go and buy one. They're lovely. Thirty pounds. Baskets for you. That's what I should have said to you. Baskets for you. That's the uh, business. 
Can you tell I'm getting tired now and I'm hungry? Yeah, I'm getting hungry. One more, me love. There we go. Everybody's Last one's on the now. screen. There it is, Primrose Resin Pendant at £9, and this is made by the lovely Resinate. If you would like one of these, they are beautifully handcrafted and made from real primrose flowers. It's a beautiful, chunky piece. It's a lovely statement pendant with wood and real primroses set into the resin. Set on a 45 centimetre black cord to really complement the flowers, this piece is full of the joys of summer with its bright, bold colours and would beautifully complete any summery outfit. The resin is light and easy to wear as it is made with high quality and non-toxic resin. The Primrose Resin Pendant captures the beauty of nature in resin and the pendant measures approximately 5 centimetres in width and it is 4 centimetres long. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's it looks like, like a, a piece of, you know when you throw wedding confetti? It's yeah. like a piece of it's been captured in time and put into a resin yeah. pendant. I quite like that, like a snapshot of summer. Ooh, snapshot of summer. Maybe someone should call something that that does it with flowers. Like yes, that. that's, that's a good summer. a good name that is. Yeah, so check it out, mate. It's the copyrighted Trina. Yeah. Snapshot of summer. Right? <laughs> See, you can't use it. It's trademarked. No, no, I have royalties on that. No, I'm only kidding. Um, but yeah, they are the lovely products that we've had this evening. Thank you for letting us share them for you and with everybody else. Uh, I really do have fun doing this with you, Vicky. You do make my night so much more fun. I like doing news. Uh, just I'm a bit I'm tired a... today. I'm not normally this tired, but it's been a long it's week. A week? Yeah. Um, I think Chrissy's doing some news tomorrow, and I think I'll be jumping on with her. Oh, okay. I, th I, th I don't know. I think that's what she said. I think that's what she said, but I wasn't sure if that was confirmed. or. But if it is, uh, I'll be watching. But we'll, we'll, we'll go with I think, and then I can't be wrong. <laughs> So you'll be um, spoiled if, this if week. Not, then we'll see you Monday. Yeah. One of us, anyway. Or two of us, or all of us, you know. <laughs> yeah, we still all haven't, two. all three of us haven't jumped on yet, which we said we would do. No, we keep banging on about We'll have to do that one day, and just surprise everybody. Yeah, we keep banging on about having this threesome and getting all cosy. It's never happened, though, No. It? <laughs> it's got to happen. We'll have to surprise everybody one day. I think I'm going to go off to me group in a minute. I'm uh, over in a touch of truth. I think I'm going to have a bit of a rant. A bit of rant coming on. Might have to see you over there, Vicky. Yeah, I'll be over there. I'll come Jump over. On, I love a good rant, me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you all soon. Take care. Thanks, now. guys. See you soon. Bye-bye.